Hey guys! It's another Wine Wednesday with TNA. How are you guys today? Good to see you! Today we're talking all about no hangover. Because sometimes when we tell people that our wines give you no hangover, they look at us like we're crazy. crazy. Yeah, they're like, uh, it's alcohol, it's gonna give you a hangover. Right. And yes and no. So there are a couple of reasons why you actually get a hangover. Okay. And the first reason and the primary reason why you get a hangover is from drinking too much, you become dehydrated. Um, alcohol does tend to dehydrate you. And when you are drinking alcohol, you're not drinking as much alcohol, or you're not drinking as much water. Right. So the next morning you are dehydrated and that just makes your body just kind of feel that bleh, kind of like crap sensation. Like you want to die. Like you want to die or hug a toilet. <laughs> um, so that, that is the, pr the first reason why you feel so bad with a hangover. The second is all of the additives that are in wine also can react with your body, causing different reactions and initiate different like histamine cascades and can cause sulfite sensitivities and all right. that kind of stuff. Um, so it's all the crap that they're putting in, in the wine that makes you feel so bad the next day. So I think kind of, you know, my personal experience with Scout and Cellar and the clean crafted movement is that I came to her house, had four glasses of wine, woke up the next day with no feelings whatsoever having gone out the night before. So, yeah. you know, there are articles out there that you can actually Google that talk about do natural wine to produce less of a hangover. Well, we're here to tell you that that's true because we've had tons of customers tell us that I really felt like I hadn't drank the night before with the Scouts or Clean Crafted Wine. Yeah, and while, you know, the company can't officially say it's a no headache wine or no right. hangover wine by any means, um, you know, we don't want to get in trouble with the FDA, um, but we can tell you um, different customer reports and how her and I feel, you know, the next morning. And I have literally put the one bottle to the test and drank an entire <laughs> bottle and I felt fine the next morning. Um, and like Tracy said, but prior to Scout and Cellar wines, Tracy could not drink right. really wine. Yeah. Tito's all the way. Tito's. Yeah. That's not, a, that's not a plug for Tito's, but we just want to be real here. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, so, is Scout and Cellar a no hangover wine? Yes and no. But more, more yes. Anyways, all right. We'll see y'all next week. Cheers. Cheers.